wave released by the particle accelerator explosion. Meet Captain Clone. Don't worry, I'll come up with something cooler. At least Multiplex won't be able to hurt anyone else. I told you I'd come up with a cool name. Or at least a way to stop him from turning into a mist. The Mist! Okay, that's his name. End of discussion. I figured out a way to track Captain Cold. You gotta stop naming these guys. 427 KPAs. Her troutal rating is around 45. That's the same as any plastique. Plastique? <laughs> First try. Didn't really think this one through, did ya? Karate Kid style. Behold. I call him Girder. For the record, not my idea. We could have called him Blackout. He had a name, Cisco. Make you tear each other to pieces. You will all die! Blah, blah, blah. No prison can hold me. Heard it all before, pal. Adios, prison. I liked Rainbow Raider. Okay, you don't get to pick the name. These weren't made by Kaboom Boomerang. Kaboom Boomerang? Yeah, you know, he has exploding boomerangs. That's not your best. Really? It makes perfect. Just go. <sighs> oh, screw you, Captain Boomerang. A yellow blur. Just like the one that killed Barry's mother. Then we need to get cracking and stop this speed psycho. That, I wasn't trying to give him a name. Check this out. I think we can fashion an electronic barrier, right? We set up a ton of supercapacitors, we smooth out the inflection points, and voila, a kick-ass force field to trap the opposite flash. That was me testing out a name. <laughs> what do you think? Still not enough. It will be. You keep working like you are, you stay focused like you are, and you will be ready the next time your man in the yellow suit comes around. I think you mean the reverse flash. What? He said it. Not me. And he's right. Yellow suit, red lightning, and evil. The reverse of Barry. Meh. Actually, I kind of like it. When the heat gun was fired, it increased the surrounding temperature of the air dramatically. Sort of like an extreme heat wave. Heat wave. Stop doing that. Okay. You've lasted a lot longer than I would have thought, Cisco. And you didn't last 10 seconds against the flash. Hmm. I was thinking of calling myself Pied Piper. Hey, I assigned the nicknames around here. Although that one's not bad. Mark's powers seem to be a lot more precise. To be able to control the weather like that indoors? You'd have to be a weather wizard. Ooh, been waiting since week one to use that one. Our very first external metahuman sighting. I'm calling her Vixen. Because what? She moves like a fox? Because she is a fox. Check out that hotness. The trickster proudly welcomes you all to the new disorder. Talking in the third person, that's never a good sign. You're just mad because he named himself. Actually, he didn't. So have you, uh, picked a name yet? Uh, I'm kind of partial to the Adam. You married to that, or...? We need to stop this bug-eyed glasses woman. And her mini bandits. Bug-eyed bug -eyed bandit. bandit. Got her, she's in an abandoned greenhouse. I've had some practice with sound waves recently. I think you should call it the canary cry. I like it. Thank you. What about... Death Bolt? Nice. <laughs> mm. You know, you're the only other person who's good at the names. I heard you came up with Captain Cold. What do you think I should be called? Female inmate? Oh, come on. You made my gun. Least you can do is give me a badass alias. Please? Fine. Golden Glider. Smart as sexy, Cisco. Well, doesn't change the fact that your nifty little time sphere... Oh, is that what you're calling it? Whatever it's called. It's gonna blow. Oh, this right here, this is a little something I'm working on. I'm cooking it up for Joe and the task force to take down metahumans. I think I'm gonna call it the boot. Oh, here are the receipts. That's where you'll find your atom smasher. <laughs> because he, he absorbs atomic power, and he, well, smashes. Come here. <laughs> That's a great name. Welcome to 
Welcome to the team. Thank you. They belong to a metahuman I fought before named Sand Demon. I know you're new here, so I'm just going to break it down for you. The whole naming the bad guys thing, that's my jam. But you know what? I'm going to let you have that one, because I actually kind of like it. I'm not mad at that one. Is that Barry Sweatshirt? Podcast from a Star City vigilante who is calling himself the Green Arrow has spawned a massive Catchy. outcry of both. I hate it when they put a color in their name. Exactly. It would serve as a kind of cannon. A speed cannon. Hmm. We should hang out more. Turns out Central City is missing one. A Jeremy Tal Cisco says we should call him Double Down, which doesn't exactly make sense since he was getting a tattoo in the Dark Matter wave hit. That's it. It's like one of those uh, controlled fusion devices. Um, Tokaman? Yes, exactly. And the more powerful they become, the more unstable they become. Barry, make him angry and he'll blow his fuse. Barry, did you hear I was right about King Shark? Mm. King Shark. Nice yeah. name. Yeah, I'll King Shark her. almost ate the Flash. Oh, no. I'm sure the Flash had it handled. Oh, no. And now you need a cool name. Oh, snap. You're totally right. Oh, I got to think about this one. Well, you know me, it's got to be perfect. Mm -hmm. Something that really sings, you know? Something like... Vibe? Vibe. Vibe. Oh, great, that could be this year's cold gun. Maybe another criminal can get it, and then we'd have Sergeant Slow. I would never let that happen. Sergeant Slow is a terrible name. I'm not changing my nickname. I like Speedy. Are you familiar with my body of work? If you are, then you know I can come up with something so much better than Speedy. You okay? I'm gonna have to learn how to use these things. <sighs> You'll get the hang of it, Hawk girl. Yeah, that's nice. I'm gonna talk to Kendra for a minute, He-Man. <laughs> talk, man. Thanks. He's slowing down everything around him. And that is why we call him the turtle. I've got the facial recognition software running, so we'll be able to spot turtle before he makes his move. Turtle. Why do you insist on giving them ridiculous nicknames? Me. It was the genius that came up with Zoom. So whoever killed him is like a walking tar, tar pit. Mmm, too slow. It's okay. Killer Frost and Deathstorm. You know them. More importantly, they know you now. They know that you're here. So, Caitlin and Ronnie's doppelgangers are evil? <sighs> Those are some dope names, though. This the name is Vibe. Reverb. Actually, not the worst name you could have come up with, but not the best. <laughs> it's called Velocity 9. Ooh, it's a sexy ass name. What is it? Yeah, social media app for the win. Bad Flash is back. Bad Flash. What? No. I'm losing my touch over here. Eliza, is that you? Oh, Eliza is not here right now. My name is Trajectory. Oh, why do the crazy ones always name themselves? Look, Eliza. It's coming. Did you even go? The time race. That's a good name. Looks like that's a yes. So what are we going to call him? You mean like a nickname? Yeah. Cisco does it for all of them. He's like the master of it. Can't just call him suspect on a motorcycle. Hey, eh? What do you think? I don't know. I'll take this one. Uh, the crook? Lame. A five-fingered. How about Thief? He robs stuff. Let's just call him Thief. All right, we'll keep at him. Alchemy is the one that gave Claris back his speed. He's kind of like a doctor that way, don't you think? Come on. Don't pretend like Dr. Alchemy doesn't have a nice ring to it. Oh. Her name's Frankie Kane, but she's calling herself Magenta. Me. Well, he's more than just a criminal now. Apparently, he's a meta who can travel through mirrors. Oh. Oh, I got this one. He's a um, mirror master. What the boom? That's good. Thank you. Says she has the ability to induce crippling vertigo. Oh, um, uh, uh, she's a top, a... like a top. She's a top. That's her name. Top. Amazing. What? You want to go? Okay. Any luck with the regulator? We took off Cyberwoman. <laughs> Cyberwoman. I think I'm starting to like you guys. <laughs> Do you know that thing we used to talk to Savitar? Yes. Meet the electrode halo. So basically, these two are linked electromagnetically via gold tooth. Gold tooth. Yeah, it's kind of the Cisco Ramon interdimensional equivalent of Bluetooth. Kind of proud of it. Anyway, it's the fire accelerant used in all of the arson cases associated with Heatmonger. <laughs> Such an embarrassing name. <laughs> I like it. I think it's great. I'm so proud of us. That was a good hustle out there, Team Vibe. It's Team Kid Flash, but thank you. Okay. Temporarily, yes, but Team Kid Flash is on the case. Son. 
I love you, but ain't nobody feeling Team Kid Flash. It's like too many syllables. Samurai's back. Uh, more like Samurai Jackass. Nope, that's a rough draft. It was, it was really cool. Team Kid Flash had everything under control, so. That's, that's not right. Right. But still, we have some mysteries left to solve. Like our flying samurai robot, android samurai, samuroid. Oh, we back, baby. <laughs> Seriously, that girl's a hazard. Hazard, that's the one. Maybe that means the jinx is gone. They're not picking up. What the hell just happened? Who was that Medusa man? You know that is not a Cisco approved name. Look, we're desperate. Sure we are. So I think we should give the Council of Wells a chance. Council of Wells? It's a pretty good name, right? Yes, it is. I know. All right. All right. Fellas. Fellas, will you? A thinker. It's good. Absence of menace. Nailed it in one. I call it the calm after the firestorm. What is it? I'm not here to fight crime or get a code name, just to brainstorm ideas about my powers. I hereby christen thee brainstorm. Oh, come on, man. Here. The fallout from a nuclear explosion could be catastrophic. Exactly. Fallout. Great name. Terrible power. The elongated man? It's just an expression. It has a certain, I don't know, je ne sais quoi to it. I like him, too. Well, I hate it. Mm. Well, maybe you should have let me do the naming. Exactly. Oh, don't worry. You'll get your chance. There's no way this is going to stick. Probably, Probably going to stick. stick. Well, I can't sell that to a judge. So if we want to get Big Sur out, we are going to need a confession from Dr. Shrinker. Dwarfstar! Oh, oh, what the hell is that? Well, that's what I'm naming him, see? Dwarfstar. Oh, God. So is he Bowen can control music? More like sound waves. Sound wave. It's a great name. It would be if it wasn't already taken by a transformer. Mm. Nay. Melting highly concentrated bonds. Melting point. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta write that down. Okay, great. So you guys figure out how to get this Mr. Melting Point in the same room as DeVoe and not get his brain sucked out. I'm gonna go get a couple of bear claws and go back to my room. It's not Mr. Melting Point. Look, it's just, it's just Melting Point. Yeah. I call it a Sonic Scepter. <sighs> okay. Points for alliteration. We're moving this fast, we're moving in flash time. Then we don't have the time necessary for a breach to form. Exactly. And I'll protect the Argus agents from the blast using this ice shooter. Ice shooter. Do I have to call it an ice shooter? I thought frostbite sounded good. Guys, it solves the friction offset problem by shooting ice, therefore it's an ice shooter. You call it an ice shooter. Relax. It's just not that hard. Uh, and your nickname is Excess. Clearly not my doing. No, uh, it's a nickname that you gave me when I was a kid. Mom. Mom. I mean, I just didn't think it was a big deal. It was only Gridlock. Mm. Gridlock, huh? Boy, the future's got some great names. Or what do you call someone who can compress air molecules into solid blocks? I don't know. Block. And that, God, that mask. Like one of those porcelain dolls that's gonna kill you while you sleep. Mm. I thought it was more like a ragdoll. Yeah, that's right. Still got it. Hold your applause. May I introduce you to Hal, <laughs> Robbie, Data, and Colossus. <laughs> I don't really like those names. Wait, at this rate, in five minutes, the temperature will be negative 460 degrees, AKA absolute zero, at which point he can inject himself with my serum. And turn himself into a full-on icicle. Icicle, that's not the time. Oh, well, it looks like she's way beyond the experimental phase. Ooh, weather witch? I'll allow it. And I am gonna start working on facial wreck for this acid master. Yep, that's what I'm going with. Always trust your gut, kids. But since Ramsey's the only one who can create more blood brothers, I say we hit him first, then Dark Flash. The anti-monitor, is that uh, set in stone, or can we workshop that a little bit? This is why I have been preparing all of you. Where did Barry race off to? Perimeter search. Make sure this isn't a trap set up by the anti-monitor. Ah, uh, that name makes me want to barf. Nice heavy back vibe. Uh-huh. New name. New suit. Guess no one's consulting me anymore, huh? Wait, what exactly happened? I searched these tunnels, asked Nash for Marnovu to kill him, expose him as a false god, and now I'm being controlled by another god. And that's the 
and team monitor. So we've got a brand new, more powerful, murder-happy Dr. Light on our hands. Another new meta surprise, courtesy of Earth Frack and Prime. Why does this feel so familiar? Wasn't there someone who could, like... If you're thinking it's Turtle... Yeah. It's not. This meta doesn't just slow down time. She can create potential energy force fields around individual victims, aging them centuries in the blink of an eye. This wasn't Turtle. This was Turtle 2. Sorry, I was just waiting for you to come up with a better name. No, it, it's Turtle 2. Less is more. Until we figure out how much, we need to manage your speed output. How do we do that? I call it the speed gauge. I mean, shouldn't we be focusing on that berserker who killed Abracadabra instead? Frost has a point. Where are we with Fuerza? Fuerza. Spanish for strength. Look, She-Hulk was taken, okay? Right. And it means that Fuerza and Psyche must be connected somehow. Psyche? He's a psychic psychopath causing psychosomatic symptoms. I mean, the guy practically named himself. He could stop you in your tracks anytime, anywhere. That's his power. It's like he's the opposite of the speed force. He's the still force. Which, I guess, would make Fuerza the strength force. And that would make Psyche the sage force. <gasps> I checked out Alice's brain scan and I had major deja vu. Folks, we've been on this exact emotional roller coaster before. Well, Sort of. Last time, it was Roy G. Bivolo. But our new meta makes people happy, not angry. Enter Rainbow Raider 2.0, which means we already... Awesome. I'll help Jackson Professor Stein. You deal with Weather Wizard. Why do you let Cisco name the bad guys? I ask myself that question a lot.